Hey guys, I'm LB, and the reason there haven't been any videos for a few days is because I had a medical emergency and had to go to the hospital. I will tell the full story in my next live stream, but for now, let's check out 2 Plus Rooms version 2 by SP2G50000. This map was updated from the original because a few hours after I posted the original one, I realized a huge break in the test chamber, making it too easy. Many test subjects may not like one test chamber, so we decided to push the limit, going into three rooms. Let's see if this will help us solve science to the limits. Aperture Employee. This is the first Puzzle Maker map I made that has a custom thumbnail. This is Puzzle Maker, not Hammer. I hope you enjoy this puzzle slash test chamber. Alright, I'm guessing it's... Even though it's Puzzle Maker, it must be Bmod to get the custom thumbnail, or you exported it and uploaded it yourself? I don't know. Let's get started. Hello. Yeah, this is Bmod for sure. Alright, so... We already saw some foreshadowing, I guess? What's with this... What's with the slants? Just to show off, I guess? So that's the exit. We're gonna have to eventually go back here, I suppose. Yeah, okay, I see. Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! Alright, so Dot turns off this fizzler, apparently. I'll keep that in mind. Oh wait, what? Dot... Four dots. Okay, that's... that's not actually signage, never mind. This turns off the fizzler. What was I thinking? We have a cube here. It says, do not hit your head on the cube. Ouch. Too late. I already did. Yeah, so that turns off that, but we need this fizzler off in order to get a cube in there to jump up back where we came from. Let's see... This is... what exactly? Why would I want to press that? Oh, I heard a fizzler. There must be a fizzler somewhere that gets turned off by this. But I don't quite know... where. Alright, so. First order of business. Not quite what I want to do. How about... Yeah, that's not gonna work. How about instead... Ooh, interesting. Can we hit both at the same time? I don't think so. We need both to open the door, though. Alright, we can hit this, at least. Let's see what that does, right? That turns off a fizzler, I'm assuming, right? Yeah, but we can't actually see anything now. Huh. Do I really have to find some weird way to do this? It doesn't seem right. I do this and this. Yeah, that's not gonna do what I want to do at all. Alright, that's it. Much better. Versus if we do this... There is no way that I can see to have my cake and eat it too. That is, like, as close as you're ever gonna get. Come on. Come on. It's not gonna hit, is it? Because it's 
button is in the way. Yeah, now it's hitting the wall. How is this supposed to work exactly? Am I missing something obvious? Because I can't get in here at all. There's a button right there that would turn this off. I feel like I have to go in here to progress. I do have to aim this over the button and stand on the button. That's- yeah, that's less of an angle. I need it to be... It to be, like... Need to be like this. So close. Oh my goodness. Not this again. Yeah, it's not gonna help at all. supposed to do that? We need more of an angle. I don't think this is possible unless through extreme precision. Yeah, that- this is not- that's not- that's not gonna happen. How is this supposed to work? Am I really missing something obvious here? Like, if I were to turn off the physics on here, nope, there's not much I can do in here. I need to turn this off. That requires X, which I have not found yet. I need to go in here second. That's why it's got two dots on it. This also has two dots on it. And I can turn that off, but there's nothing for me to shoot, so I can't even get in there. Am I really supposed to do some weird, finicky laser angling nonsense here? Cause... this looks impossible. There's no angle that makes sense here. Unless I have to, like, re-fire the laser through the portals or something insane like that. Huh. That's not quite helpful. Still not the right angle. It's so bright over here, I couldn't even see the laser. I'm not sure what to do here, but it must be some weird laser angle nonsense, to be honest. That's all I can think about. Is it aim assisted there? What's going on? 
Why can't I place it slightly to the left? Looks like there's an aim assist there. Yeah, but that's not really helpful, is the thing. It's still not the correct angle for that. Can't see a way to do both. Do we have to do the one frame glitch? Is that really what we have to do here? Oops, wrong portal. The fact that that's aim assisted is suspicious to me. Really? If that's- if that's the intended way, I'm not a fan of that at all. Hey, this one- oh, it does have signage. And it's a regular cube. Interesting. So there's X. I guess this is the idiot test? <laughs> Why would I ever go down there? That's like the worst mistake you could make. Except now... Can't go back anyway. Alright, so... All we gotta do is turn off that fizzler. There we go. <laughs> Give me this cube. All right, now, X, X, X. How are we supposed to get back there now without doing what I already did? I'm sure this is our... Oh, no! Okay. I know what this is for. Okay, aim assist. Actually, put that there. Aim assist, thank you. Yeah, that'll work. Alright, let's go back through here. Yeah, there we go. Didn't even notice that before, so now... Now... Good enough. Good enough for me. Hooray! Let's save. And... We don't need portals anymore, right? Who needs portals? I think I might be a way to keep your portals, depending on how you do it, but... I think we're pretty much done at this point. Let's take our optional weighted storage cube with us. To the exit. Bam, there we go. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!